Okay, so today I have two sewing makes to share with you and the first one is Simplicity 5555 and this is a vintage Jiffy sewing pattern and it's only two pieces so it's really quick and easy to put together and it's like a little halter top that can be worn in multiple different ways and um, it ties in the bag. Well, the way that I wore it in the clip, I had it uh, tied in the back and then of course tied at the top uh, around the neck area. Um, and I just made it out of some knit fabric that I believe I got from Joann's. I can't really remember, but I think so. And um, yeah, it's really hard to, to kind of see what it looks like in my hand, but I will show you what it looks like on, of course, so you will get a better idea. And then the next sewing make that I have is Simplicity 8886, and this is a skirt. And I made it out of a linen-like fabric. And it's that skirt that has the big pockets on the side. And when I saw this skirt pattern at first, I wasn't too crazy about it. I wasn't sure that I would like it. But it was something about it that just piqued my interest. So I thought I would just give it a try. And I'm so glad I did because now I really, really like it. And it's become one of my most recent favorite makes. So I really like this skirt a lot. And um, it has a lot of gathering going on at the top and then there is an, an invisible zipper in the back um, I will say with the instructions just to take your time which you probably already do whenever you're making something but I wasn't taking my time and I ended up having to unpick a couple things because I thought they went together I thought I knew what I was doing and I didn't so there was one piece in particular when it came to putting the patterns together I'm sorry the pockets together where you're supposed to put the wrong sides together and I ended up putting the right sides together yeah because that's what i'm traditionally used to doing so i ended up having to go back and unpick so i would just say you know if you do decide to make this just you know um be be careful because the directions are right <laughs> and um i just kind of messed it up and had to redo it but it's okay it turned out okay and um yeah that's pretty much it i will show you what it looks like on and i wore the two of them the two pieces together in the video clip so i had it on as a full outfit and i liked it together so you'll get to see what that looks like coming up That is my outfit that is what I wore and um, so I want to leave you with a love share so the love share for today is that you can actually have your toenails removed permanently now that is something that I did not know that could be done and I found that to be very interesting and in fact some runners who don't want to contend with constantly um, having bruised toenails ingrown toenails or constantly constantly losing their toenails because they run so often sometimes they will opt to just go ahead and have their toenails removed permanently and that way they don't even have to worry about that so I thought that was so interesting and it sounds extremely painful but yeah, that's something I wanted to share with you. And thank you so much for watching. And I will see you in the next video.